open middle problems, uh, they, the, the biggest thing is that they have an open middle. Uh, a lot of problems uh, that we do, you all begin with the same problem, so the, the beginning is closed, and you end with the same answer, so the end is closed. But where I think the most interesting part is the middle, where there are many different strategies. Uh, sometimes there are open-ended problems where there are multiple correct answers, but the key thing about open middle is that many different strategies can result in the same answer or similar answers, and then these great conversations come out about how the strategies are related to one another. Some people, if you've been traditionally really good at following steps, it's going to be a shock in some ways because what you may have seen yourself as uh, good at math because you can follow the steps well, well, this doesn't really necessarily work anymore. Conversely, there are some kids who have thought, I'm not good at math because by traditional sense, they are not just following the rules. But you see them engage and open up and like this electricity. When you start off with the right kind of problem and then work their way to a, a standard that they're familiar with, you'll find kids won't want to stop. They'll complain if you don't use them often enough. And it's just like a, a crazy paradigm shift.